Hi everyone, Joe Ordia here for Solar Surge, and today we're joining you from the RE Plus Southeast Regional Solar Conference in Atlanta. And this afternoon I'm joined by Nick Bayamonte from Generac, and we're going to be looking at the new Generac Power Micro and how that system works. So Nick, th thank you for joining me this afternoon. Yeah, thanks for having me, Joe. Great. So I know I've been hearing a lot of buzz about this, and we've got some inquiries about it. Um, tell us about the new Generac Power Micro, and how, how do microinverters, or how will microinverters um, kind of work their way into the Generac PowerCell um, solution? Yeah, happy to do it. Um, so uh, as of July last year in 2021, uh, Generac acquired Chillicum Power. Um, they're a California-based company, so uh, you know th one of the great parts about this is it's made in America, um, has ARRA compliance, so you can use that on government projects. So the acquisition happened in uh, July, um, and we are going to be rebranding this, the Generac Power Micro, like you mentioned. Um, really, right now, it is a parallel product to our PowerCell, uh, but will be integrated into the PowerCell family. So whether you want to do DC or AC coupling, uh, depending on you know contractor or customer preference, um, you could do either one without going to a different manufacturer. Um, so really gives us a lot of extra flexibility and uh, uh, a lot of uh, versatility uh, in the market, being one of the few manufacturers offering multiple products, whether they be DC or AC coupled with a battery. Right, right. And I know, you know, some folks do have a preference for, for the AC coupled architecture or the microinverter architecture because it's, it's, it's more resilient, right? You don't necessarily have a central point of failure. Um, other folks prefer a DC coupled architecture because of the more efficient off-grid performance, more efficient DC to DC battery charging. So is this something where they're going to be able to kind of take advantage of the best of both worlds? Exactly. I mean, really depending on what the customer wants, if they want to get down to granular level, you know, panel level performance, uh, yeah, go with a microinverter. If they want to make sure there's redundancy, go with the microinverter. I mean, there's very you know, few and far between failures on the central inverter as well. So we still have that option and we have very few power electronics on the roof with the DC coupled infrastructure as well uh, as it stands today. So um, yeah, really you're just able to offer multiple flavors and give the people what they want and what they need. Great, great. I guess one other advantage of the microinverter system, and that's what a lot of folks like, is, is actually being able to track on the monitoring software and be able to see each individual solar panel's uh, power output. Um, I noticed that you have a have a display module here. Uh, what what type of information what type of information is available to the homeowner uh, through the, the monitoring system? Yeah, so great question. Um, basically, this is the brains of the system uh, for our Chillicon soon to be Power Micro. Not much will be changing in that change as uh, in the uh, you know, the rebranding as well. Um, so you'll be able to track production, consumption, uh, temperature of panels, voltage of panels, voltage of grid. There's a there's a lot of information in this little gateway. Um, a lot of things that people like about this is it's a tangible device that goes in the home and it's kind of like a hub. So you're welcome to recess this into a wall when you walk into the foyer. Um, you could just simply place it on a countertop in the kitchen or maybe in the garage. Um, and you know, a lot of people, you know, pay a lot of money for an investment and they really like to show off investments, especially their family and friends. So the ability to kind of have that hard device in the home um, and not just simply open up your, you know, your app on your phone, which we have as well, um, you know, is, is another, you know, talking point and selling point of this product. Yeah, no, I agree. I think we've seen that, you know, one of the best solar salespeople out there is a homeowner that has the app that wants to show all their neighbors because they, they, they you know, they want to see how the system's doing and how it's performing. So it's nice to actually have kind of a console that you can you can have wall mounted, almost like a thermostat. That, that's kind of what it looks like to me. It's almost like a thermostat type device that you would have on your wall where you have your solar control panel, uh, you know, right next to your HVAC or something like that. Precisely. I mean, it's a, it's a big selling point. I used to actually sell Chilicon in my previous role in distribution, um, you know, when and you know, Q4 crunch was on and supply is low on, on other manufacturers. And you know, th this was a huge selling point in pivoting a lot of uh, installers. Um, I think another cool feature as well on the passive marketing side, um, you were, be able, were able to put um, installed by the installer in the bottom left corner. So while they're showing off that investment, that's another you know, easy way to get a, a referral opportunity. Right. So for you installers out there, if you know you're looking to increase your referral base, you know there's another branding opportunity for you right there uh, on the console. So, so Nick, when when is Power Micro going to be available in distribution uh, for you know the first units to actually be installed? What, what do you think? Yeah. So we should be expecting a rebrand this summer. Um, you know, so very very soon. Um, right now there are uh, you know Chillicon, a Generac company. You know the the current lineup in distribution as well. Um, we're getting a lot of extra traction uh, with a lot of installers across the country. Um, so yeah, coming up really really soon. 
Now, I know one of the questions that folks are going to have out there is, you know, how does the, the, the power micro, or, or today Chilicon, but what will, will be the power micro, um, what kind of power handling will it have for some of these new higher output solar panels like we're seeing now 400 and 440 watt residential solar panels? So great question. Um, so right now as it stands, it's called the CP720. And 720 alludes to the AC output that we're able to do. So 720 watts and it's a dual micro inverter. So 360 watts per channel. Uh, so uh, you're able to you know, basically get more performance for less of a cost to the homeowner. So really you're increasing that return on investment and decreasing that payback at the same time. Um, so yeah, you're able to throw a 440 watt on here, especially in a hotter climate like Texas or I, I, I am in Florida. And uh, you know, usually you won't see that many days where you're hitting that nameplate value on that solar panel. So uh, yeah, 440 watt panel would have minimal clipping. Um, and it also gives a lot of extra flexibility to the installers as well. If you can get a much better you know, rate on a 440 watt as opposed to what you're used to doing with a 360, you can make that jump to that panel, you know, that extra 80 watts, but not have to go up another microinverter line and pay another $25 behind every panel at the same time. So, um, you know, one SKU can do 60, pa uh, 60 cell panels, 66, 72, uh, and even, you know, higher voltage 96, you just may have to parallel on the input side. Excellent. All right, Nick, well, thank you so much for taking the time to explain the new Power Micro to us. Um, hey, guys, of course, if, if you're out there and you're in the process of looking at solar power options for your house, um, Generac is one of the most popular brands that we work with. We have the, the Generac system available in over 16 states, as, as I'm recording today. Uh, so as always, if you need to get some specific pricing for your house, uh, or if maybe you already have a price quote, you want to just get a comparison quote to make sure that you're getting a good deal, uh, as always, feel free to reach out to us on the link below there. It'll just take you to our website and let you schedule a short virtual meeting uh, with one of our team members here. Well, Nick, is there anything else the audience needs to know or should know about Power Micro? I think we covered a lot of it. I, uh, I obviously like to speak a lot, and I think I got it all out. Great. Yeah. Well, we certainly appreciate it. I know the audience appreciates it. Uh, hey, guys, as always, if you're getting good value from the information that we have on Solar Surge, uh, be sure to click on the like button. That'll just tell the platforms, you know, to make the video visible to more people. Uh, and also consider subscribing to the channel as well. Uh, we're trying to get you guys the best information. You know, our, our approach here at Solar Surge is you know, not, not even really to, to push one product or another. It's, it's really to make sure that, you know, you homeowners out there, especially who are researching different solar options, maybe you can't be here at the solar conference to meet all the different companies, but we want to make sure that you have the information so that you can make the best choice for you and for your household. Well, I thank you for taking time to share with Solar Surge today. As always, I'm Joe Ordia, encouraging you to get prepared and be empowered. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next video.